Hey everyone, how's it going? This game is called Everybody's Gone to Rapture. You guys know I love me some story games. I got this, I think it was in the autumn sale. So I thought that we would try it out, even if it's just a uh, one episode off, if you guys aren't interested in it um, after this episode or if you would like to see more. As always, please let me know in the comments. But I just, I really like the look of this um, main menu. It looks really really good i don't know why i don't know why i really like it but i do so we're just gonna start this is dr Catherine collins i don't know if anyone will ever hear this i'm hearing it now it's all over okay i'm the only one left oh no okay so i think it's safe to say it's not like it's not like a zombie thing it's not something like that um but it does look really really good it's like i've said before you guys know that i enjoy my story games um and if you don't know then i do <laughs> i really enjoy story games one of my favorites was what remains of edith finch that was a really really good one and that's slightly what this kind of reminds me of um so hopefully it will exceed my expectations of it um but i'd been on my wish list for quite a while but it was on sale during the autumn and i decided to get it and i decided we would check it out so this is this is very 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 beautiful very pretty um i have no idea where we are we're we gonna go to get the radio Oh hi. Ooh, this is cool. I'm going to continue to broadcast for as long as I am able. If I'm right, we should be able to pick up the signal right across the valley. The event has left markers. We don't understand it yet. We're going to keep working to try and understand it. You can use them to find what you're looking for. The answers, they're all here. The answers are in the light. Okay, so that sounds like freaking creepy. Um, the answers are in the light. Um. Okay, so I'm guessing that is the code for this somehow to get in here. Um, maybe I have to enter it. Can I jump? Oh, no, we just walk over there. That's cool. Oh, can I pick up these tools? Can I pick up these tools? Near. Okay, let's find out how we open the gate. Okay, so it doesn't look like I can type in that code anywhere. Um, we can't run, so it's definitely something you can, we need to take our time with. But there's a cell phone. This is a special announcement by the Emergency Measures Committee. Due to exceptional circumstances, radio and television in this area has been brought under the control of the EMC as per the Crisis Preparedness and Action Bill of 1982. Is that it? Did I walk too far away? Did I? Can I play it again? No, okay. We can't play it again. Um. Oh, look, these must be the lights that she was on about. Okay, let me just let me just check inside this van. It's kind of eerie because you literally are just thrown in and you have pretty much no clue as to what has happened to everyone. Okay, so. What have I got to do? Okay, I would rather not. I am 
slightly confused as to what I'm doing. Why do I have to slide it? I am really confused as to what it wants me to do. Is that what you wanted me to do? Thank you, little light. Oh goodness, oh goodness, oh goodness. Okay. okay, was that wrong? Was that wrong of me? I'm trying to do my job. You two will be the only staff on site for this rotation. I'm just saying, if the main gate's power fails, then there's no way in or out of the observatory. That's why there are backup generators. Jesus, why the hell are we even discussing this? Just don't you come running to me if you get locked in. If we get locked in, we won't be able to come running to you, will we? <laughs> you let us worry about the clever stuff and you can concentrate on sweeping up leaves and changing light bulbs. Happy? Now piss off. Oh. Arsehole. That was unnecessary. Just because you're angry with me doesn't mean you have to take it out on everyone else. Okay, can we just talk about this? Mm. Steven, I'm done. I just want to get out of this place and tonight is our best chance of doing that. You prep the arrays, I'm heading up to Tower 6. Okay. I love you. You know that, right? Yeah, I know that. Why is she pissed then? Come on, let's get started. He just told you he loves you, goddammit. Why are you so angry at him? Um. So. Do I go the way that they went or do I go this way? I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go down here because this is the way that that man went oh it's saving as well so i don't think it was such a bad idea to come this way um but yeah i mean it doesn't look so bad now it's very confusing i don't know if this will be something that you guys will be interested in oh god it's gonna make me do that thing again jeremy jeremy where are you going come back back um but yeah as always please please let me know in the comments if this is something you would like to see more of or if it isn't either way is absolutely fine with me i just don't like doing things that you guys just point blank are not interested in whatsoever um okay so the road's closed well i suppose from that we can assume that they really are serious about this whole quarantine thing if Mrs. Balton wandered off that way before they closed the road, I suspect we'll never find her. Not until this whole thing blows over. But it's more than a little odd. I mean, this is Yorton, for goodness sake. There was no need for them to be so rude. Well, if they are so concerned that they are willing to close off the roads, I suspect they would argue that there is every need. What is certain is that for the time being, none of us are going anywhere. But he had a rifle, a soldier with a rifle in Shropshire. The world's gone stark raving mad. I've a good mind to write to my MP. <laughs> you do that, Bob, and I'll personally deliver it for you once this blockade is removed anyway. Come on, Bob. I can't spend all day chasing pensioners around the valley. The surgery won't open itself. I need to grab some paracetamol when we get back as well. Fucking headache all of a sudden. Okay, this is definitely, definitely English. Okay. Um, I got one here. Are there any cows? Did they take the cows as well? Oh, poor cows. Um, 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 these lights, I do like to follow them. They're very pretty. Um, okay. Do we find the paracetamol? Oh, wait, the phone's ringing. The phone! Okay, pick this stuff up. Oh, somebody was going somewhere. Can I open? Oh. Who's that? Hello? Kate, if you can hear this, you need to shut down the optical array. It's using the observatory as a conduit to reach us, and it started spreading its range beyond the valley. Kate, we can't afford to let it do that. It's getting stronger. I'm going to call Clive back, and I'm going to force him to order the strike. I just don't see what other choice we have. 
Okay, yeah, I'm just gonna get out of there and freaking close this. Oh, that's creepy. Do you know what this reminds me of? Have any of you guys seen that film with Nicolas Cage where, like, he has to ship his little girl and there's this other little boy that goes with her um, onto this alien spacecraft because the world is literally going to, like, be destroyed. Um, it reminds me a little bit of that. This is slightly creepy. Um, but it's really cool. Graphics look really, really nice. It looks like a little English village. I don't understand what this wants me to do. Okay. Don't be so hard on yourself. We've all had rejections. You haven't. <laughs> Come on. We'll look at the figures, tighten up the data, and resubmit. Your core ideas sound... You just got the number slightly wrong. Don't patronize me. I'm not patronizing you. I think you are a brilliant man, Dr. Appleton. Listen. I'm here, right? We're together, you and me. The alignment event tomorrow. It's yours, okay? You saw the opportunity, you ran the numbers. Even if they can't see it. I'm proud of you. Is that supposed to make me feel better? See you then. Look on the bright side. I'm around here? <laughs> You're a hero. Prodigal son returns, right? <laughs> I'm surprised they haven't erected a statue in your honor yet. <laughs> oh, you can laugh all you want. But I'll bet the parish council have a subcommittee working on that right now. <laughs> <laughs> okay right this is really creepy that took me quite a while to get that to actually show me that little event um but this is a very very english little little town we got going on here we got a little pub we call them pubs um I mean, this is really quite cute and quaint. So cool. Oh, I love it. Okay. Um, Ale of the Dead. 50p? Where the hell is this place? Pub quiz, curry and a pint. Only two pound. Oh my. Ah, oh, this is awesome. Okay, I don't know why I like this so much. Okay, fish and chips. 50p for an ale though? I do think that that's a bit... That's so like... You can definitely, definitely, I can tell you now, go into a pub and you will not be able to get an ale for 50p. I guarantee you. Especially if you like, you come here, you would definitely not be able to get a pint for 50 freaking p. Oh my god, 50p? Okay, that's so cheap. Um, do I, can I use this? Was somebody listening to music and then they got zapped out of nowhere? Okay, so I can't go in there. Everybody has literally, it's just like you were going about your business and all of a sudden everybody has just disappeared. And I can't help but think that it was aliens. They were doing something in the tower and... Oh wait, there's a radio over here. They were doing something um, to the tower and it like connected aliens or something. I don't know. Uh, private parking. Customers only. I feel like I have to remember this. I keep looking, but it makes no sense. The area we picked the pattern up from can no longer be located on the scope. That's just not possible. You can see significant changes to the quality of the ambient light in that part of the sky. It's overexposed. Like a Polaroid left in direct sunlight. Okay. Right. 
Okay, duck it. What I am going to do, this is actually so cute. I'm definitely going to play this, um, whether you guys would like to see more or whether you wouldn't. But for the moment, I'm going to... No, oh, they, uh, hi, wait. See me as an outsider here as well. Is that supposed to make me feel any better? Oh, I understand it's difficult. That's all I'm saying. Your lot up at Vallis have never mixed with the local community. People here, they don't really understand what you do up there. Are you trying to get me to come to your church? <laughs> it's not just about faith. It's about the community. Be involved. Be seen as part of it. One of them. <laughs> Good morning, Father. Lovely day. <laughs> oh, hello. Uh, Mrs. Appleton, isn't it? It's Dr. Collins. Lady scientist. Whatever next? Good morning, Barbara. Oh, my God. <laughs> Father Wheeler. You really think that's a community that will ever see me as one of them? I can live with them staring at me, if they just stay out of my way. Well, that woman is a bit of a bitch, if I do say so myself. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to leave this video here. This is so, so, so cute. It definitely looks like, it looks like a little town or a little village that like, I've seen it before in like Wales or somewhere like that. It's so cute. I love to live in a little village like this. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so so much for watching. Just look at these thatched houses. Oh, they're so cute. Um, I think that they're quite expensive to maintain though. Anyway, this just got completely like completely weird um but yeah thank you guys so so much for watching this video as always please please let me know if you would like to see more or if it is something that you are not very interested in either way is absolutely fine by me um but i do always like to play something that you guys are going to enjoy as well there is another one of those little lighty things um but yeah thank you guys so so much hit the like button leave comments down below do not forget to subscribe and i will see you all in the next video take care bye